Hey y'all, Shayla from Making Lemonade for Lemons, and today I thought that what I would do is take you guys back through where I left off, uh, where the last video that I had was talking about the reason that I have been absent, um, and at that point in time I was waiting on some medication to help with my shoulder pain, and um, if you haven't seen it, I will link that, I believe it's right there in that corner. Um, so what was going on, of course, I will give you a little synopsis, is that I have been having nerve pain from my degenerative disc disease and I was waiting on medication for uh, that to help reduce the pain and I did receive my medication and I took that and it did help with the pain for about three days and then on the fourth day I started getting the pain back again so the steroids even though I was still and I'm sorry if you hear Bella she's chewing on her bone under the table <laughs> So I'm sorry if you hear you guys hear that, uh, but um, I was the steroids. They helped as long as I was taking the the heavy dose part of it. But once I started weaning myself off of that, then it started the pain started coming back again. So I did contact my physician. Uh, they did a virtual appointment and sent me for an MRI. So in that time I have done some filming of little bits and pieces of things that I have done um, whenever I was feeling well. The problem is that I really wasn't feeling well enough to do any major filming. I, like I said, I just have a few video clips here and there of things that I got done. And so that's kind of what's been happening. I've been getting some things done and, you know, about halfway through, I'm like, I can't do anymore. I've got to stop. I've got to quit. I've got to go lay down because of the pain. So. I will take you through a little bit of what I've done um, and at the end I'll let you know I'll let you guys know um, what the MRI said so one of the things that I did since the last time that I talked to you guys is that my boys and I went down to visit Big Bear Homestead in Georgia and we had a meetup with several of my Marco Polo friends and um, it was a great time and you know it was a much needed break from <laughs> as as my middle child just said Isaac just said from reality <laughs> no it was reality it was actually fun it was a really good time the boys had a great time they have become fast friends with uh, Jason and Robin's girls and so um, that's been a great thing. Uh, another thing that I have done since then is I did do some planting outside. We did do some cleanup of the summer garden and got it's mostly just greens that I'm growing this year. I'm not really going to be growing a whole lot else during the winter, but I've got brassicas, um, mustard greens, collard greens, turnips, you know, those types of things so that we can get the greens. We don't really eat the turnips very much them in and of themselves, um, but not because we don't like them because we haven't really tried them but because we never get a, a big bulb on them so um, but we do eat the greens a lot we like um, I have more kale growing for kale and eggs because my boys love kale and eggs 
and so um, just various things like that uh, that I have a lot of them planted I have the the bags I think if you guys haven't seen them I if you if you're new to the channel and haven't seen I grow everything in in grow bags and this year I did uh, buy huge 200 gallon grow bags and these 200 gallon grow bags are what I grew my beans in this year and so that's what I'm growing my um, turnip greens my mustard greens those types of things so I also have some of my other grow bags filled with greens as well um, and my, some of my other grow bags have uh, some of my other grow bags have cabbage and broccoli and that kind of thing I ha also did uh, harvest my and I say I it's more like Nick harvested our sweet potatoes and uh, our second round of potatoes which didn't do well this time um, and I'm pretty sure I know why but um, we'll save that for another day uh, but we got my garlic planted so this next year we will have a good um, set of garlic it's the garlic that we grew last year was phenomenal and we have had uh, lots of garlic toast <laughs> since we harvested our garlic because the, my boys absolutely love it so anyways uh, and then I've done some projects mostly around um, around the house with crocheting because I can do that while I'm in my room but I can't do it for long periods of time because it will aggravate my shoulder pain so um, we also have gotten a new incubator and we are doing a test run on a new hatch so I will um, I will see about getting you guys the results of that hatch after um, so we'll compare the first incubator with this next you know the our new incubator which is one of the styrofoam types which is the little giant so we were actually really excited Evan and I tried to do an unboxing and I got part of it done um, but like I said I wasn't able to finish be fil filming it because my shoulder started to hurt so that's pretty much kind of been how everything has gone I will get things done and I will get um, you know I will just get part way part of the way done and then I have to move on and, and just quit for the moment so um, that's why I haven't been releasing any videos but I'm hoping I've had more more better days recently than not uh, I do have a few recipes that are going to start coming out uh, for the fall season and well fall and winter season and so I'm excited about that when I had my MRI and that was in October so I had to wait all that time to get my MRI done it was about a month from the time that I started taking the I started taking the steroids until the time that I have had my MRI and so the results came back pretty quickly um, in fact almost immediately my doctor was calling me back my MRI scans were showing that my degenerative disc disease has gotten significantly worse and they are referring me for the third time <laughs> to a neurologist, a neurosurgeon. So 
I have gotten the packet of information for who I will be seeing, but I still need to get an appointment set up. They said that they would be calling me, but if they didn't call me within a certain amount of time for me to call them. So I will probably be doing that within the next few days. So um, I just wanted to tell you guys what has been going on here and um, I hope that the clips that I inserted into this helped you to see kind of a little bit of what um, we've been doing and I apologize for being gone so long and I appreciate all of you guys who have stuck in there with me and have encouraged me and know that those of you who are YouTube creators that I'm subscribed to I am still watching you it's just that there are lots of times that I cannot um, comment I appreciate everyone who is um, who has continued to subscribe to my channel and who is just waiting for me to come back and I really do appreciate that uh, so thank you guys for spending the time with us today and we'll see you soon